Oh, Shai, Shalom to the house of David, by Yafda Allah, 144,000 and one-third men, women, and children, probably the elect of the 12 tribes of Israel, you blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans, and the Israelite foreigners scattered in the four corners of the earth, confusing the faces, speaking the different tongues. Basically, we're going to real quick just do a shake. We, uh, we're going to do a kale, cilantro, bananas, and, and, and coconut milk. Basically, we're pushing health. So through the spirit, we got bananas. Which almond milk, you gotta stay away from that regular milk. That regular milk causes mucus and has a whole bunch of hormones in it. It's best to get almond milk, you know what I mean? Or brown rice or goat milk, if maybe, you know? Put some bananas. Bananas has a lot of vitamins, has potassium. Bananas also good for blood pressure. It's a natural laxative, too. You know, you need that, you know, all the shit that we eat, all these foods that we eat with the pesticides, and even when you so called eat vegetables and stuff, all the pesticides they spray on it, you know what I mean? That's why so many people are sick. But diseases start from your colon, that's your energy source. Like the monks would say, what would the monks say? Uh, your G gum? That's what they would say, right? Move us some bananas. You know, I try to take care of your health, man. Yeah, we in hell, but you know, this truth is about bettering ourselves, first our minds and our bodies and stuff, you know? Also, we pray over the food. You know, we just got beamed down from the ships to edify the sheep. <laughs> We're gonna get a beam back up. So yeah, we got some kale. Usually cut up the kale. I, I usually put the branches in there too, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's good to get red kale, because red kale, like the brother um Ma, uh, Makaza says, neurobiologist, he says that that the red kale has uh gold and he you know he enlightened me in that, and it's true. It's very good for you, man. That kale is very, very good for you. You gotta have that on deck. Coconut milk. Maybe like two or three scoops of that. This will fill you up too. Usually we put um usually I put almond. Usually I put almond butter, but we don't have that right now on deck. So what we do have is I this is my secret with it. I got spirulina here. But spirulina has as much protein as meat. It's a herb that's grew that's grown in Peru. I have that on deck too, you know what I'm saying? Put that up in there. Look it up, man. Some good stuff. It really has a lot of good. It's an antioxidant. Another thing we're going to get too low willing is that wheatgrass. Low willing, we're going to get We're going to get some wheatgrass, which wheatgrass alone, a shot of wheatgrass is like, a shot has like 19, has 19 amino acids, vitamin A, K, D, E. It has, uh, um, it decalcifies your penile gland because your penile gland is supposed to be soft, not supposed to be hard. So it decalcifies that. You know, I think a shot of it is like two and a half pounds of vegetables. Mm -hmm. You know, it's good to have that. They have the, the machines is a couple of hundred bucks to buy, but you get the um you get the manual ones. You know, the manual ones. That's just good, man. Uh, brothers and sisters out there gotta take care of your health, man. I try to take care of you. Put some greens in there too. You know, greens is good for the heart. It's good for blood pressure. You know, get your energy. It's usually good to put the get something with greens in the morning. You know, how they say wheats and oats in the morning. You get your carbs because the carbs gives you energy. You know what I'm saying? We, we try to take care of each other's health, man, to the best of our ability. You gonna put the uh, cilantro in there? Yeah, I put some cilantro in there already. Can I say something about yeah, go that? Ahead, buddy, go ahead. <clears throat> the cilantro, when you look up uh, the the properties that it has, man, um, all from all the metals that you've had in your body yeah, since when you were younger, out, yeah, yeah it, bind, it binds them out. You know, the aluminum and all that shit. That's why Issachar is so heavy in the uh, cilantro, putting cilantro on their food, man. It's spiritual, you know? And this spirulina, I'm telling you, y'all got to get this. You get it like for 350 an ounce, y'all got to have this on deck, man. Mm -hmm. Put some cinnamon in there, too. You know what? It also affects the way you are, the way you feel too, man, during the day. You know what I mean? Usually we have a rigid, we have a um, straight the cinnamon sticks we originally make, but uh, we just have this for now. You know, the way you eat, the, it, affects, it affects the way you think, you know what I'm saying? The way you feel. That's why our brothers and sisters out there, y'all got, got to eat better, man. You got to push that. And I'm not saying I'm perfect, you know what I'm saying? But you got to make the attempt. You know, when you, and also too, when you fast, you break your fast with some wheatgrass. You know what I mean? Break yourself with a, with a nice little wheatgrass, with some vegetables, you know, or with some fruits. Eat a green salad. Yo, man, that, that really, 
it, 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 it amps up your frequencies and your amps, man. You actually feel it. You get better dreams, better visions. Like you always say, uh, mm-hmm. you know, it, it makes you, it fights off them demons, which is real, man. That's our weapon. Yeah. You know, yeah. really, that's what they, the monks do that. They be fasting. They, they even call themselves the disciples. They go on, they go on group fasts and stuff. You see the shit they do on the left hand side and that's part of the heathen Buddhism. Yeah. <laughs> Also break your fast too with some veggie juice. We're gonna start doing more videos on that too, Lord willing, you know what I'm saying? Huh. And and I'ma say this, um with the fasting too, you know, you there's different fasts that you can do too. You can do a um like when you read water the book fast. of Yep, water fast, like when uh um Uriel told uh Ezra's to do a, a only eat the uh the the flowers of the field, talking about the uh the plants, you know, when when he does a half fast, you know what I'm saying? But the more common fast that we do do is the no no food and no water, but you can fast from meats and stuff like that too. You yeah, know? yeah. Hey man, it came out good. First time I made this. Tastes good, man. I said, you know, I take care of your health better. You know, our brothers and sisters out there, we, that's what we're going to start pushing more and more. Cause we used to do that. We kind of like slacked off on the videos. But Lord willing, we're going to start pushing out that health, man. Our meals too. You know what I mean? Meals. Because this thing's about uh, how you move. You know what I mean? This thing. You got to take this truth with you. And it's, it's how you move with it too. It's, it's, it's everyday life. The way you eat. Everything. The, the spirit of the Lord is in that to everything, man. The way we eat. Exercising. Brothers and sisters out there got to exercise. You don't, you don't got to go crazy and do no fucking Spartan 300 training, but brothers out there should be taking care of their health more, exercising, fasting, and pushing one another, eating better, trying to eat better, you know, because we're fine with sports demon Satan. That's why he puts chemicals and sprays the chemtrails and everything, so we're in a constant battle. You know what I mean? So, Lord willing, this uh, this edification for you brothers and sisters out there, you know what I mean, to, to drink better, you know what I mean, drink your smoothies, get into your health more, you know what I'm saying? You know, shalom. Write the comments too, man. Comments out there edify us on things that we don't know. You know, we're learning from each other. Iron shop and iron, you know what I'm saying? We're constantly learning. Shalom. Love you.